So here's a problem I think everyone has bumped into. You take a picture of more than one person and one of them looks good in one picture and the other one looks good in another picture. I want to show you how to bring both of them together into one image that looks great using Photoshop. We're going to start here in Bridge and I'm just going to click on one of these images and hit the space bar to preview that. And the problem's pretty obvious here. My mom is blinking in this shot, but my little boy and my dad look great. If I use the arrow to advance to the next shot, my mom looks great, my little boy is looking off camera. Let's hit the escape key and now we're just going to shift click to select both of those. We're going to come up to Tools, Photoshop, and Load Files into Photoshop Layers. It's going to launch Photoshop and put both of those images into layers. Now, if I toggle that, I'll see that I've got my images, but they're a little out of alignment. So I want to shift click those and come up to Edit, Auto Align Layers. I'm just going to leave this to Auto and let Photoshop find common content between the two. If I toggle this, I'll see they're perfectly aligned. And the thinking here is you want to put the image that you're going to cut through on top. You want to select that one. So this is the image that we want to cut through. With that selected, I'm going to click on the mask icon here and add a mask to that. Now I want to choose my brush and what I want to do is use Control Option or Control Alt and drag left to right to resize the brush. If I want to adjust the density, I can drag up and down with those Control Option or Control Alt keys held down. Go for a medium brush. The other thing I want to make sure is that my color my foreground color is set to black, and I can toggle those right here at the bottom. With that set to black, I just take that image, paint over it, and her eyes pop right open. Really easy to do. So let me show you another workflow from within Photoshop. It's slightly different. I come to the File menu, come down to Scripts, and Load Files into Stack. Same idea, different name. I'm going to go to Browse choose the images that I want. Just going to shift click those, click open, and here I'm going to say attempt to automatically align those images. So do that step for me. These are raw files. Photoshop's going to bring them both in here. It's going to align them automatically, and I'll see when they align that they were handheld. This overlapping area around the edges shows me that they're definitely out of alignment. And if I toggle them, I see that in this image, I like the lion that's looking at me. But if I look in the background, the image, uh, the line to the right, he's looking away. Where the image in the foreground, the line to the right, is looking a little more towards me. So that's the one I want to cut through so that I, again, can see the one looking at me. I select the image that I want to mask through. Again, I create a mask, make sure I've got my brush set to black, and I'm just going to paint over this. And because all of the content is aligned, it matches up really nicely. So really common problem. Everyone's bumped into that. Really, really easy to solve in Photoshop if you know the right steps. That's a great one to add to your playbook.